Hi, this is Tim Yoder with Fit Small Business. Today I'm going to be evaluating fresh books on Chapter 5 of the Fit Small Business case study. This chapter deals with fixed assets and long-term debt. So our first task is to record the purchase of a job trailer for $12,000 by borrowing $12,000 from Bank One. Okay, so let's start with some of the basics here. Let's see if we can set up a fixed asset account. I believe there already is one. Um, let's go to our chart of accounts. So the, the, the accounts with the dollar sign are the system accounts, um, the parent accounts. Um, so we do have a property, plant, and equipment account. We have some various uh, accounts here. Okay, excellent. So we do have accounts for them. Um, let's see if we have a note payable account. So, uh, yes, I remember when we set up our chart of accounts, we did do this loan payable account, um, but there is no parent account that we can call loan payable and we can't create additional parent accounts. Um, so we are just stuck it under our unearned revenue, which is not correct, but we had to get the account somewhere. Um, so that is what we did. Okay, so now we want to record this purchase. So what the purchase is, is going to be debiting equipment and crediting the loan payable. Okay, well there is no way to make journal entries within FreshBooks. You're going to have to ask your accountant or make yourself an accountant, log out, log in as the accountant and make the journal entry. So um, no way to record the purchase of this equipment um, because we can't make journal entries. Okay, so um, now, so let's score it here. So record the job trailer as a fixed asset. No, we can't. Um, view a list of fixed assets. Nope. Record the note payable as a long-term note payable. No. Nope. Okay. So let's look. See. Let's see if there are any other uh, fixed asset functions because they do have a fixed asset um, category here. Okay. So I've done a little bit of research um, and they do not have any fixed asset accounting in FreshBooks. So they do uh, in their help section, they give you links to some other software that they recommend, um, but there is no fixed asset accounting uh, within FreshBooks. Um, so some of the other tasks, uh, the case that he asks us to do, record the job trailer as a fixed asset and depreciate it over straight line for five years. Can't do any of that, set up the note payable um, on an amortization schedule, we can't do that. Um, can we record the sale of the asset? No. So we're not able to do really anything with fixed assets. So assign an ID number to the fixed asset. And this is actually pretty common. Bookkeeping software, now both, most, most bookkeeping software will allow you to record the purchase by debiting fixed asset, crediting note payable. But that's all most software does. FreshBooks will not do that. Um, but all of this other stuff, depreciation schedules, uh, amortization schedules for note payables, most bookkeeping software does not do that. Uh, most bookkeeping software leaves it. The fixed asset management software is generally a separate software. Okay, But it is disappointing that you can't do a journal entry to record the asset, to record the purchase of the fixed asset. Um, again, your accountant can, um, but you as it logged in as the user, as the owner, cannot make the journal entry. Okay, that's it for Chapter 5 of FreshBooks.